this next clip is going to be about the problems that you may encounter when you're doing your port forwarding. After you do your port forwarding, sometimes that you may find out that the ports are still not open. Sometimes it could be due to ex extra factors such as a bad cable or firewall restrictions inside the router. One of the first things I will recommend doing first is inside your router, if there is one, go into what's called the DMZ settings. The DMZ settings stand for Demilitarized Zone. What that option does is it allows all the ports on a particular IP address to be open. So in this example here in the Linksys, we're going to go to Applications and Gaming, and you'll note here that there's a DMZ option here. You'll click on that, and you'll see here there's an Enabled and Disabled option. If you click on Enable, you want to click on the destination IP address and put the particular IP address of the DVR. In this example, 137, and click Save Settings. After that you do that, you would want to go to the port forward tester again and check it. If the ports are open, then the problem is solved. Sometimes that does not fix the problem. Sometimes it may be due to a firewall or security setting. So if that is the case, then you would want to go to the security or firewall settings in your router. And you want to see if there's any settings in the router that prevent any port forwarding from being done. Sometimes there's settings such as preventing port scanning, so those that you generally want to uncheck. Go ahead and try to disable the firewall settings, save the settings, and then retest the ports. If the ports are open, then the problem is solved. Generally, I wouldn't recommend disabling the firewall first because that allows a lot of problems to occur because your firewalls are down. Try to do the DMZ settings first.